welcome back to my channel um today was just a heck of a day um and yesterday i did not upload because i had filmed some footage and it just came out really bad um and so i wasn't able to post i will try to make up that post i'm not sure how or when um but i will try to make up the post anyway so today what did i do so I have had blessing bags on my mind for the holiday season, um, but when I went to Walmart, Walmart didn't have blessing bags on its mind. <laughs> so I went to Walmart looking for blankets. Um, I had seen someone else on YouTube do a blessing bag tutorial and they included blankets in the blessing bags i'm in my bag guys but they included blessing they included bank they included blankets in their blessing bags and so i wanted to do that and i was on the phone with christopher if you don't know who christopher is you should see my last video but i was on the phone with him and he said if you're gonna get a blanket you don't want to get one that like sucks right because it, the point is to keep them warm not to just look cute um, and so I was able to find four twin size, um, fleece blankets and they're really, they're pretty big. Um, anyway, so I bought the four and I was just like, I'm going to go with this. And then if I get some more, then I will do some more. Um, anyway, I ended up packing the blessing bags and I was like, I would really like to get my kids included in this so I unpacked them and I allowed the kids to repack them for you guys and I also had the kids include um, some little kind of like message cards to go in the bags as well I did film me making the message cards but I did not film me putting them in the bags I don't think um, but yeah, so these are our blessing bags and I hope you like this video. Remember that this is the season to give to others, especially others who are in need. Um, and while it, you know, a lot of people are in need during this pandemic, but while it may seem like some people are maybe faking it or what are the cases, you can't give to someone with the thought in your head that they're they're trying to take something from you you just give with an open heart and an open hand and you allow the blessings to flow back to you so i hope that you guys enjoy this video and stay tuned for the next couple of clips so here was our sort of packing station uh, we laid everything out on a table and the kids prepared to get started we included a toboggan a pair of socks, a pair of gloves, deodorant, chapstick, dental floss, toothbrush and toothpaste, cough drops, lotion, a sanitation kit, and a blanket. On top of that, each bag had $10 in it. Now, granted, there's no food in these bags, but I didn't want to put something in there, like I said in my last video, that had the possibility of, you know, making someone sick if they were allergic or if they have bad teeth breaking a tooth off the goal is to try and help these people um, and that way and that's why we gave them the ten dollars that way they could go and grab something to eat most of the people that I see out are typically around food places or the food places is within a five minute walking distance from where they're sitting or standing so keep that in mind when you are giving to others so here the kids are just taking their time packing each bag granted there were only four bags it was a little bit difficult for the kids at first because we put the rows so close together um, but they were able to get everything together get everything packed up um, and they were actually excited to do this this is something they actually wanted to do so I was really happy about that so here all the bags were finished the kids just stacked everything up and then I prepared each bag to put some cash in them so 
so here I am pulling out the cash um, I had $40 so I just gave $10 to each of the bags and this is just me opening each bag and shoving the $10 in there um, originally all the bags do have a zipper front pocket and originally I was going to put the money in the zipper front pocket but then I noticed that the zipper was not that great one of the things that you will notice most of the time when you see a homeless person is that they have a backpack that is great so that means they don't need this little sack that I have but it's a lot more sturdy than a um regular bag that you would grab finally here's the card that I made um for each kid to put into a bag and we just made sure that we put those inside of all the bags that we gave out all right guys well I hope you all enjoyed this video um I hope that you all can use this as an inspiration to bless someone in your community and with that, I will catch you tomorrow. Bye, guys. Got questions or comments? Leave them down below. Click my pictures to the right to get more content like this. Click the little picture to the left to subscribe to this channel. And I will catch you in the next one. Happy holidays.